Well, look what we got here. It's, um, I think it's onyx or maybe feather. <laughs> I can't even tell the difference. No, that's feather. That's feather, the cat. So that's feather, the black cat, and Goldie's the gold cat, and then Putin is the gray cat, and Rocky's the tiger stripe guy with tiger stripes on his head. So they're all getting along. That's a good sign when they're all freaking hanging out together. And actually, Onyx, Onyx and Feather, um, be getting along good with Gold Digger, the white cat with the black hat. Yeah, that's good. Cats do pretty good as long as they got a lot of food. So, figured I'd put us a quick update here. The uh, I'm gonna go outside here and uh, check out my motorcycle, make sure the other tires are. I'm debating on whether I'm gonna take it tomorrow or not, but uh, it's not a far trip. Just that I don't want to lug around my leather jacket and helmet shit when I'm trying to film everything. Um, it's not a far trip at all, but I just don't feel like lugging that stuff around when I'm trying to work the camera. So, but we're going to check out the bike right now, see if the transmission's flew full. I know the tire's been holding air good. The guy had those in there good. Good seal on the bead. So, yeah, it's feather. That's feather. She's small compared to uh, the son. The son is the puppy. <laughs> little kitten. He's like nine. What is he now? Um, I guess he's nine months old, maybe. Something like that. Yeah, he's about nine months old now. Little, little kittens are nine months old. I <laughs> gotta take him in and get him fixed. She's fixed, though. She got all her shots. See that? You guys doing okay, huh? <laughs> I'm glad to see they're all getting along really good. I'm happy about that. I'd like to get those other two guys in here. Maybe what I'm going to try to do is set up a litter box and put some sand in it. So if we got some sand, get some beach sand or something. Uh, they can use that instead of the, the, the clay. They'll probably be okay with that. So You notice they all protect the, uh, <clears throat> the Confederate colors. <laughs> That's what these are. These are Confederate mink blanket cats here. So, hold the gang's okay. There's Daddy, Daddy Boots. There's his son Onyx. So, no problems. He were just took a little nip out of Dixie. Thought it was a playful nip, and he just got scared of crap out of him. And uh, see, there's the old bike. Was checking the tires. The tires are still full. The trans was almost full. Of course, just a little smidge of oil in it. Yeah, maybe I will take it tomorrow. I don't know. It's a perfect day, so. The thing is, I don't like parking. I, I'm just not familiar with where the hell you can park it. That's what I don't like. Anyway. So. Right, boops? I'm going to take it. I'm going to take that thing out tonight, too. It's going out tonight. I'll be taking it out riding around tonight. Gonna get that little flag out there in the air. Actually, some truck came by tonight and was honking his air horns at the flags. You can see him from uh, County Road. <laughs> so, yeah, give him a few treats. Some Temptations catnip flavor. I usually don't have those in the store, but when I have them, I get two of them. Right? And I took down some, most of my Christmas lights now. Still got the tree up. You see, I took them off this pole, but I still got them across. Oh, and I got the, the flag, the 3x3 three three square flag is coming for this. The pole on my El Camino. But, uh, this thing, I got them up here, which is cool. That goes with the, you know, <laughs> the flags back there, so. Yeah. And I'll be yeah, I'll be taking this out tonight, so definitely get it out tonight. Just like I'm a little if if I feel leery about where I park it, um I won't film nothing. I will I'll just I literally will not film anything. I won't film the event. That's that's why I probably won't take it tomorrow, I'll probably take the car. What I'm thinking of doing is I'm probably going to get a a thing that you could plant in here. I used to have these alarms and shit on it. 
that every single alarm I had broke. And that, maybe that was because they're older electronics back in the early 90s. The you know, vibrations kill them. Like the mercury switches, pff, freaking, they, they just always broke. But I think today you got some, I'm going to get a, a thing where I put it on a bike. If it goes bye-bye, I'm going to be able to track it. That's one thing I, you know, because I keep locks with it and shit. The chain is supposed to be pr pretty cut, cut resistant. It's around the sissy bar in the back. I even just got a bicycle cable lock, thick cable, that, uh, you know, it's something where you just can't grab it and grab and run, you know. You just fucking you can loop it on a, the, the little lock in the front there. I had people mess with crap before. Even in the Marine Corps, just people get drunk and they do stupid shit. People do stupid shit. People you trust. So I, I don't. I keep my eye on that damn thing, man. I like where it is now. I mean, it's chained down. I got a microphone, cameras. <laughs> you know. <laughs> so I don't like leaving it out of my sight. Yeah, but I might bring it down there anyway. I'll just pull it right up to the event in a non-parking area. <laughs> I'm cavalry. I don't give a shit. I can freaking go here. <laughs> I can go here. I'm cavalry. <laughs> I can drive here. <laughs> What's up there, green eyes? Yeah. This guy's a yo-yo man. He's a good cat. I really don't want to take him in and get him fixed because I feel like it's terrible, man. I'm just glad they, they grew up with their testosterone, you know, for most of their growing years. So when they get some mass on them, <laughs> I don't really don't want to get them fixed, man. But I guess you got to. Or else you have too many cats. Because even though they're males, they're going to be finding females and maybe kittens and wherever they're going and shit and be like, snowballs out of control. Like the Tribbles on Star Trek, you know? They're all over the place. Oh, these cute little Tribbles. They're all over. The freaking nine of you doo-doos as it is. <laughs> anyway. Let me get to uploading this video and I'll be taking that little sporty out of here right now. It's tonight. Get them colors out there. Man, I've been working my ass off on a lot of shit. It's like I never get done everything I want to do. As a matter of fact, I gotta take, I gotta fix the electric fan in that thing. It's not the relays, it might be the fan itself. I don't know what the hell it is. Not a, probably not a big job if it's just the fan itself. Um, but even if I can't fix the fan, even if I can't fix it, something really crazy with the computer, I can just mount a switch and <laughs> make it work. Um, what else I gotta do? I gotta put the springs in the back of this thing. Not if essential. Um, gotta put the clutch, flywheel, pilot bearing, probably the clutch fork. I did change out the Z bar stuff and the bearings and shit and the bracket and stuff on the clutch linkage. But it needs another clutch. I mean, the last time I put a clutch in there was in 1993. <laughs> and then on that Suzuki. I need to get the stainless steel exhaust system complete and I probably got to change the rear seal on a trans. Not a lot of shit. And I might do some more work. I got some stuff. That's just why I was checking the transmission on this thing. I, I got to, um, there's a, a O ring seal that goes by the clutch cable. Um, that should be changed. Also, the seal by the Shifter fork. <coughs> that's where. The, that's probably where it's leaking. Probably that shifter fork seal and the clutch cable seal or some shit. A little bit, real little bit. Uh, I change that. Change out the primary chain. Um, change out the front sprocket. I already got the parts. They're not essential though. They're not really that bad. That I don't need to do right away. I don't really need to do any of this shit right away. But stuff I got to do. <laughs> it's like I got all my right away stuff done. That flag was killing me though. Putting these flag, that big flag up, oh, man, that freaking was way more. That was way more involved than I thought. Right, boo boo. Huh? 
What's doing the Christmas lights, putting up the Christmas lights, taking them down, putting them away, troubleshooting the Christmas lights, man. <sighs> man, a lot of freaking work. So, it adds up. <laughs> so, I don't know where the Dixie and Paws is, but they're probably around. See if we go around the front and see if I find them. Well, I don't know where Dixie and Paws is. They're not far, but here's Gold Digger. <laughs> She's coming near the window now. Right? You like the little window? You're licking your, watching your face after you ate some treats and stuff. When well, you looked at it, you give you a can. Right? She no more red dots on her fur anymore, too. So, I'm going to take the bike out here in a few minutes. 